Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Ness and welcome to episode 15 on this lovely Saturday. And uh, before we get into the video boys, I'd like to thank you for uh, the amazing support on episode 14 of my Road to Ronaldo. I do appreciate it. Unfortunately, we did not smash the 500 likes target, so I won't be giving away any 50,000 coins. But hey, new episode, new rounds, new chances. So if you guys can smash 500 likes on this video, that will be absolutely awesome. And obviously, you will be entered into the 50,000 coin giveaway. All you gotta do is drop a like on this video and answer the following question in the, in the comment section down below. What is your favorite food? My favorite food has to be some fried chicken. I absolutely love uh, fried chicken, basically, Kentucky Fried Chicken. I love all the fried chicken they basically make there. And uh, I go there quite often, to be honest. But uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section what your favorite food is. And uh, let's go right into the trading of today. So, in today's first best of trading, we picked up five informed players of this week's team of the week. We picked up uh, Itami Smith first off for 78,000 uh, coins. Which we can sell on for around 90,000 coins then, so that's gonna be a decent profit. Then we picked up a Shane Long of this week's team of the week for 36,250 coins, which we can sell on for around 50,000 coins. Then we picked up uh, this guy, I'm basically not gonna try to pronounce his name because it's gonna be very hard, but he has a uh, pretty outstanding set for left back for 129,000 ultimate team coins, which we can sell on for around 200k at the moment. That is his cheapest buy now, so I'm gonna be trying that. Then we picked up an inform Altum. I think it's how you pronounce it correctly anyways. For 102,000 ultimate team coins which we can sell for around 130,000 coins so that's not bad either. And last but not least we picked up another Tommy Smith for 73,000 coins which as I said already we can sell for 90,000 coins. And as you can see on the screen boys, we did sell all of our 5 informs. In the first batch of trading we sold our inform Tommy Smith for 85,000 coins. Then we managed to sell the uh, inform left back for 187,000 coins. So that's, that is a very, very, very nice profit because we picked up for 129,000 coins. Then we, then we uh, sold our inform Alton for 125,000 coins. Then the uh, Shane Long for 48,750 coins. And last but not least, we sold our last inform Tommy Sword for 88,000 coins. Then we went onto the market again and we uh, went for a second batch of trading. It did not go as well as the first one, but uh, it is something at least because we picked up three inform Danilos and one inform Godin. The three inform Danilos were picked up for 25,000 coins and the inform Godin for 32,750 coins. I can sell Godin for around 40,000 coins and uh, my uh, informed Danilos for around 30,000 coins. So that is, it is not good, but it's, well, it is not bad, but it's not very, very good either. But uh, yeah, as you can see on the screen, ladies and gentlemen, we, we basically sold all of our plays. We sold our uh, three informed Danilos for 29,000 coins and our informed Godin for 38,750 coins. Which made us end with 1,282,000 ultimate team coins. We are getting closer and closer slowly to Ronaldo. And I absolutely do love this support on this series. Because you guys keep destroying the like button. And if you guys can do this can do this again on this video, that would be absolutely amazing. So boys, I'd like to thank you very much for watching. Make sure you drop a like on the video if you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, without any further ado, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, I'll talk to you boys on next time. Peace out.